Hello, this is Sunday's The West Country Tonight. The headlines this evening. Campaigners protest against silt dumping in a popular Cornish beauty spot. It shows how many people care, and we really care. We, we want this dumping to stop. Hundreds of people lined up today calling for the end of the dumping of silt off a Cornish beach. A fresh investigation is being mounted by the government over the licences to deposit silt dredged from the River Tamar into Whitsand Bay. Richard Lawrence reports. United they stand with a message to the dredgers. Hands off our beach. There's lots of people that use Whitsand Bay as well. There's surfers, fishermen, lots of families. So good to see lots of people here today really. Today's protest was organised by a local mother who, with a local diver, believes there's growing evidence that the marine environment is being decimated. We've lived here all our lives and we see the evidence, we see silt in the water, we know the bay isn't the same colour and we see dead baby crabs on the beach in far more numbers than you'd ever see. I'm known as the guy who's dived here for 50 years and I'm still at it, uh, particularly this end of the bay, the eastern end of the bay. Um, and in that time I've seen a change to the habitat really. I mean, there is marine life, but, but in certain places it's been devastated at times, particularly after major dredgings and dumpings. Removing silt from the Tamar is essential for the dockyard and navy base. It's a practice that's been carried out for around a century. But residents believe the debris that's dropped under licence near the bay should be dumped much further out to sea. And new MP is hoping the government will listen. Just because you have used a site for 100 years does not mean that you carry on polluting one area. And what a beautiful, beautiful spot this is. Um, the minister has come and seen it for himself. The residents say anyone who disagrees with the idea that the silt doesn't flush in should take a look at what else comes ashore. This old remnant has been here so long, this part of the bay has become known as Boiler Beach. Residents are determined to step up their campaign to ensure that Whitsand Bay remains an unspoilt beauty spot for future generations. Richard Lawrence for the West Country Tonight.